Hello everyone, this is Alex and Mr. Retro Central, and today we're just going to be playing some fast RMX. And what we're going to be doing with it is we're going to be playing it, going through it, uh, just briefly, because I don't want this video to be too long. It's just kind of a video where it's just showing you if it's something maybe you want to buy, or maybe you want to have a look at the gameplay or what it's like and before you make the purchase. So this is kind of what this video is about. So we have all the different modes here. We have options where we can see the controls and adjust them. Graphics, you can change some UI. Uh, music volume, which is always overly loud for some reason. Um, sound. Uh, then we have time attack, which is pretty straightforward. Uh, you just kind of race the time. And then we got championship mode, which is uh, similar to the Mario Kart one, where you'll, what you'll do is you'll pick a course, or like a cup, sorry, and then you'll get three courses. So we're just going to play that quickly. Going to pick Card Caradon. Pick that vehicle. But yeah, this was a Switch launch title and it was pretty good at the time. Welcome to I'm not too sure how um, vibrant the online community is now with this game. Maybe it's dead, who knows. So that's what we're going to find out. Alright, so we're catching back up to the front. So yeah, so A is to accelerate. Getting really into the, this race. A is to accelerate, uh, X is to change the color. It's the final uh, I'm not sure what Y does, I'm not sure what B does. The triggers, they make it uh, like kind of drift left and right, kind of like a lean. Uh, the right bumper is to boost. They get the orbs, and that gives you the boost. And we also got the, the boost on the ground. They got to match the color. You and right on the top. That was pretty quick, actually. So we're not going to play the other races. Just wanted to quickly show you, and I don't, I don't want this video to be too long. But twenty dollars, not bad. Hopefully, Nintendo sees that there's a market for this genre so maybe they'll bring back f-zero all right so split screen online communication online communication with friends so you can make a lobby so that that's a good thing uh and local so we'll do online and we'll see if this game is dead or not Card i have a feeling this game is going to be dead uh which is good because that's kind of the purpose of this video you don't want to buy this game if it's dead and the multiplayer is dead. How are you going to be aware of that when you purchase it? So we'll just select any map and we'll just sit here. We're in an empty lobby, it looks like. I mean, it's not too late and it's an international game, so I'm not too sure.
Yeah, I think this game is dead. So, for the price, uh, I don't think it's worth the price. Um, especially because your multiplayer doesn't work. Or your online multiplayer doesn't work unless you play with friends. And maybe you can, like, 1v1 or something. And, like, local would work because you're local. So, same with split screen. And obviously single player would work, but the online seems to be completely dead. Uh, that's not a good thing. I mean, I could just sit here and wait, but I don't want this video to go on infinitely. So, while we sit here and wait, I may as well give you my verdict of the game. Uh, I don't think it's worth the current price, only because the online community is dead, uh, as you can see. It's not too late at night, and it's still peak times in other places around the world. I mean, it's the early afternoon here in Australia. So I'm not too sure. So that uh, is a bit worrying. If you wanted to play this game as just a single player game for like the few maps that have come with the game, then sure. But the online and the ranking system, like I've got some points, but like, how am I going to get more points? I can't. So it kind of takes a big element out of the game and especially the replayability, in my opinion, because yeah, you can race yourself, but come on, it's... 2018 now and this was a launch title in 2017 with the switch with online i know back in the day when it came out on launch it, it was uh most probably popular because mario kart wasn't out yet and other racing games and whatever weren't out yet but i don't know for the price and i, I don't know I, I don't think it's worth it in my opinion i mean we can back out and try again i guess With the same car. Join my Discord. Uh, ask me on there if you're curious. Because I'm just going to leave this on. But obviously I'm not going to be recording the whole time. But I'm going to leave this on for hours. To see how long it's going to take me to find a match. So if you're curious on the number... Um, Join my Discord and ask me on there, and I'll I'll answer you. But I don't know the price. Uh, I don't know the price for no online, unless it's friend with friends or as a lobby. I don't know. I wish Nintendo would bring back F Zero, because like the demand is here. If like similar games are being made in that style, but obviously this game is not going to be as popular as F Zero. And also being like a, a year old now, on from the Switch, or like a 13 months old. I don't know. But yeah, as I was mentioning earlier, there's that hero mode and time attack mode, and we got the championship. I don't know, the, the online, that's, that's quite a disappointment. Card Caradon. But if you like this kind of series where I, I play games and kind of show them off and uh, just kind of briefly talk about it, uh, just leave a comment in the description below of what other games you maybe want to recommend or if you do like the series or if you don't like the series or if you want me to improve on certain things or if you like it the way it is. Yeah. I don't know. At least this video is going to be out there. So hopefully someone who's interested in buying the game finds it and maybe doesn't because the online doesn't work. Or maybe they don't care and they understand it while buying it so they're not misled. Because I don't want anyone to be misled. I'm probably going to title this video Fast RMX. Is it worth it? Question mark. The answer is no. Maybe at half price? $10? Sure. But yeah, I'm just going to continuously leave this on, but I'm just going to end the video here. 
Um, but yeah, if you want, just join the Discord. It's in the description. And uh, yeah, I'll, I'll answer it for you. But yeah, anyways, I'm Alex from Mr. Retro Central, and thanks for watching.